I see you. <laughs> ah, I don't know how I missed that. Okay, so we're back, and um, remember what I said about waking up too early? Yeah, that's what I did. Um, the fire needs some stoking, so I'm going to take care of that, but I'm up way too early. But that's not a big deal, because you know what? More wood for the fire, as System of a Down said one time. Um, I can stoke these flames up a little bit, get this fire, keep it going, and then plan my day. Sun's gonna be up soon. It's kind of coming up right now, but uh, I guess in the meantime, what I'm gonna do is, uh, you know, with my vitals, make sure I address those, and then uh, start the day right. I will say one thing though. I do not remember seeing all these different freaking plants here. I didn't. They. I don't think they were here before. I can go back and watch the other video. But I don't remember it being so overgrown with this level of growth. So I'm gonna clear this out again. Get some more tinder. Okay, we're doing all right. There you go. That's the location right there. Maybe a little bit more water. There we go. Yep. Yep. Sippy. Sippy. We're good. Okay, so I got that taken care of. You still need maybe some proteins and fats. Of course, carbohydrates, but I'm going to have to branch out for that. Real quick trick. You see these bones I've been saving up I was talking about in the last episode? What you can do is you can use these as a quick uh, protein and fat snack. Just drop your water in there, drop the bone in there, watch the timer, let it shake and bake, and then eventually you will have a delicious protein and fat filled meal, as you can see right here. A little bit of energy too, always need that energy. Alright, we're pretty much ready to start the day. I'm going to pick that uh, coconut shell up put it back over here just in case it rains again so I have easy access to hydration yep we're good maybe some carbohydrates not a big deal not a big deal at all, all right. I swear to god I'm serious I don't, I don't remember seeing all this growth out here it's crazy oh scrimps get a protein boost out of this most definitely Drop this on the fire. A little shrimp on the barbie. Good day, mate. Etc. Etc. All right, we're good there. Just gonna let it cook up. I am confused though. I don't have a you know a water filtration system. I have the mud shower, but not the water. I'm I'm just I'm just a little confused by that. Like I've looked for it. I thought that's how you got it by picking up the mud, but I don't see it. I don't see it anywhere. Oh yeah, of course. Definitely don't see it in traps. Clear some more of this brush out real quick. And, and again, I swear to God, I don't remember seeing all this brush overtaking my area. But I'm going to clear it out either way. Eventually, it'll turn to tinder. Something I can use. Some face huggers here. See right here. Used to be a face hugger. Now it's a dry leaf. Let's get this a little organized a little bit. But yeah, I'll say it again. These look like face huggers to me from a the aliens movies. Look at that. Show me the lie. When you cook those uh, those shrimps up, you also get a little bit of energy. One less protein. But you still get energy, so, you know, whatever makes sense to you. You can eat them raw, too. If you eat them raw, it's a little different breakdown. So what I'm going to do is, I mean, look at all these raw materials. Did you hear that? There's some protein and fat out here. Now there's definitely, uh, yeah, here we go. There's definitely protein in this trap. But you hear those giant guinea pigs? 
That's protein and fat. And I know you guys, if you watched my last video, think I'm not that big, big of a hunter. But I'm a very skilled killing machine. And mark my words, I'm gonna get some meat. I'm gonna get some meat. Might not be right now, right now, but in this video, ah, spooked him. In this video, I'm gonna bring home a kill. You mark my words. You mark my words. Ugh. Part of the problem is there's a lot of brush here. I ain't cleared all this out, so they hear and see me before I hear and see them, so I'm still going to get one of them. I'm going to get one of them. God, this reverb, reverb I, I swear, it's, I think it has to do with the, the ambient weather sounds. I think what I'm gonna have to do is turn those down a little bit. I can't adjust the um the uh, the, uh, the video settings. I think that's what it is, because it seems like whenever it's about to rain, I get all this reverb on my recording. I'll figure it out. But you know, I didn't I didn't get my uh, my proteins and fats, but I definitely got my carbs from that mushroom that I picked up. And whatever you do. Don't just eat that mushroom. It'll poison you. You gotta cook it first. That's why I took a little sip. I got this coconut shell. Coconut husk. Put a little bit of water in there. Oop. Put a little bit of water in there. Drop the shroom in there. Let it cook up. You're gonna have some carbohydrates. Alright. Harvested a little grub out of that, putting in the bottom right hand corner so I don't accidentally eat it, and then take a little sippy sip, you see that right there, you get some carbs, and of course hydration, that puts us in a good spot, so I was going out here earlier because I was going to harvest some raw materials for our build, but I got distracted by those monstrous guinea pigs. But now I think what I'm going to do. I'm just going to get a bunch of bamboo. Some raw materials. So that I can put that build together. On the uh, structure we were talking about in the last episode. It's going to start swinging them things. But I'm not going to bore you all with that. I'm going to take care of this. And uh. Alright, so I've been working like Casey Jones out here swinging this hammer. And, um, I can hear protein and fats out here. I don't need it, need it right now, but I know I'm gonna need it, so. I've gotta flex my, uh, hunting expertise right now and bring home the bacon. I can hear it. I can hear him stepping around out there. Alright, here we go. I see you. <gasps> ah, I don't know how I missed that. But, I got another spear. No big deal. <gasps> ah! Got it right in the rear end. That's not good. Uh, uh. I'm gonna try to chase. Uh, I'm tired too, so I've been working out here, getting raw materials. He's gone. He's gone. Oh! But I just saw a pair of nuts drop. That's some fats right there. Eh. I have to call it a loss. But I am still gonna get... I'm still gonna get one of these beasts. I'm gonna drop them. I'm gonna drop them. I am committed. I'm gonna make this happen.
check which one is older. Okay. It's this one right here. Eat one more. There we go. We're good. I am gonna get a headshot on one of these fools. We're gonna make this happen. We're gonna make this happen. There we go. Got my spear back without that. Spooked him again. God. That's a problem with all this brush. They hear and see me before I do. <coughs> Got Stevie Wonder over here throwing his spear. All over too. Ugh. I can hear them all around me. Eh. Spooked them again. Just gotta be a little bit more patient with these. <coughs> Got it. Ah, uh, it wasn't a headshot though. Ugh, okay, so we lost a spear and we lost an arrow. No big deal, no big deal. This next one is gonna be a headshot. I can feel it. I can feel it. I'm, I'm not gonna shoot until I'm shooting. There we go. Got him. Got him. Done. Headshot. Thank you for your sacrifice. I'm sorry I had to kill you, but. You're gonna help me uh, keep on keeping on. There we go. All of it fits in my inventory. That's perfect. I'm not weighed down. Oh, a couple more. Uh, another another pair of nuts and a rock. There we go. I heard you out there, you little guinea pig. Oh, we got some tobacco here too. Okay, these are good. Okay. You want these. Like the last one I harvested was an antihistamine. These are anti-venom. So I was talking about how clumsy I am with um, beehives and ants. If you're clumsy with a snake, this will help alleviate the issue. And the issue is you get a fever and um, you get hydration issues. This will help prevent that. So I got that in my pack now. I'm good to go. Good to go. But I don't want to go home empty-handed without some bamboo. So let me drop this thing. Hopefully it falls the right... Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, it couldn't have fallen more perfectly. There we go. We're good. Hard day's work paying off. I love it. It's raining. So all this bamboo work ain't keeping me dirty. Look at all this. Look at this. Look at what I've been doing today. It lands. It don't make a sound. Wow. Alright. No problem. Put this on the grill. Capybara. Good, good eating. Perfect. You can also use ropes for the fire, but I, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I need those ropes. You're going to see why. Uh, I hate it when it stacks up like that all perfect. There we go. That that That's a little bit better. More face huggers. Harvest this rat. Make some protein out of it. Boom. I'm put this coconut husk back over here. I know we used it earlier for some carbs, but that's for hydration. Which we need a little bit of. There we go. We're good. We're good. Oh. 
hit there, little guy. There we go. Great. A little protein boost. Extra po protein boost. Crap these real quick. It's taking up a lot of space. The tobacco leaves and the um, that plant. So what I'll do I'll turn these into bandages with anti-venom properties. And it, not only will it I take up rest. Well, I know you need to rest. Not only will it take up less space, but if I accidentally step on a freaking snake, then I'll have something to address that. Perfect. The meat's all cooked up. Good to go. I like to, again, separate it in different areas in here. Hy hydration. Carbohydrates and fats. Bottom left, protein slash proteins and fats. And then bottom right, stuff that I shouldn't be eating at all. Because it'll make you sick. probably make another spear since I lost one I wonder if you can make it out of bamboo I'm not quite sure get this rock nope all right let me try it this way make a cutting tool Perfect. I needed one anyway nope uh, I guess you need a long stick. You can't just use freaking bamboo. You gotta use a long stick to make one of these spears. Yep. Doesn't like that at all. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. I know you need to rest. You got plenty, plenty of long sticks. Not a lot. I'd rather use the, uh, long bamboo stick but that's okay it's not a big deal we'll make it work okay i'm desperately in need of carbohydrates but i can't address that tonight so i'll just address the protein i will have to address carbohydrates in the morning most definitely out here. That's crazy. I wonder how that works. Alright, so the bamboo didn't work out. We're gonna craft with some long sticks. Because apparently that's how you make a spear. Then get some rope. Done. Let's make one more. Let's make one more. We got some rocks. Why not? There we go. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. And we're ready to party. Alright. Get some backup rope since I used two ropes. Good to go. Ugh, still need those carbohydrates. Alright, you know what? There are mushrooms out here. There's fruits that you can get. We're going to forage for a minute so that we can get our carbohydrates. We're going to make this work. I don't, I don't know what happens when you don't have your carbohydrates, but I don't want to find out either. So we're going to resolve this situation right now. There we go. There we go. These are perfect. It's a little card boost. It's not the best, but you know what? We can make it work. You eat these things, I'll just give you just a little bit of boost. Is that four of them? 20 carbohydrates. But we can find more. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. We can find more. 
But hopefully I'll run... Oh, Alright, you know what? If I can't find them, I'm gonna take that at least. Stick. Hopefully I can find some fruit. Ah, look at that. Per you know what? I'm just gonna eat these right from the vine. That is perfect. Perfect. They give hydration, which I don't need right now, but the carbs right now are more important. I'm gonna put that down there in the spot of stuff that you don't eat. We got some more mushrooms. This is perfect. This is good. This is good. This is gonna this is gonna put us in a in a good spot. See, this is what you can do. Foraging is that carbs were dangerously low. Now they're not anymore. Oh, I see some crabs. <gasps> Didn't catch him. Not a problem. You know what? That's the first time I'm disappointed in not catching crabs in my whole life. But I'll take it. <laughs> anyway, anyway, I'm just joshing. Carbs are good. We're perfect. We are Gucci Gold. 100%. Back to business. Let's get back to what our uh, whole point was, which is harvesting, getting lots of raw materials, so that we can build our empire. Oh, Kobe! There we go. Follow my way. This is perfect. Perfect. Nice. It's early in the morning. I got plenty of energy. I keep bringing this stuff back. And when I get enough, I'm going to start building. Still not a sound when you drop it. That is so weird. You know what? I don't even need to pick this stuff up. I'm just gonna let it fall. And we'll use it eventually. We got plenty of materials here. It's perfect. I'm clearing this out, but we will need banana leaves for the roof. I know some of you folks are uh, particular in what you use on the roofs. I'm not. I'm more concerned about the uh, the walls. Like, I want to have mud walls. There we go. There we go. Yeah, let's get this out of here too. You don't belong here. Perfect. This is good. I know it's not like building right away, but this is how you build a house. You clear the clutter. You pick up materials. And you put them in the best spot. Ugh. <coughs> That's so weird. Have y'all noticed that? When you pick up bamboo poles and you put them down, sometimes it sounds like you got hurt. Even though you, you, you weren't hurt. That's weird. Not a big deal. I guess in the uh, grand scheme of things, but it is weird. Get this other bamboo. There we go. Hello. Come on. There we go. Got got him too. We're good. What are you doing here? Get out of here. You don't belong here. Get get on. Get moving. There we go. Just clearing out a spot. That that bamboo is in a weird spot. I'm gonna push it. There we go. You know you can move stuff, right? That's what I just did. I need to clear this out. I don't like the way this is. I would like to expand. 
And I think this is in the way. It's not this, this dwelling is not far far enough. Down. And we can improve upon the way it was originally set up. And I'm gonna use these palm leaves or fern leaves fern leaves in certain areas so nothing's gonna go to waste but I'm still gonna keep them in two separate spots so I know what from what There we go. There we go. Yep. Clearing, make clearing the clutter out. Not can't pick that up. Yep. This needs to go somewhere else too. Boom. Y'all too. And I'll get that other one later. No family stick. Not a big deal. Starting to open up, but you know what? It still needs some cleaning. I know I'm hitting the back of it. At the same time, I'm hitting these bamboo sticks, but it's not a big deal because I'm still gonna clear that little hut section out. I don't, I don't like the way that it, it's standing. So we're gonna have to clear it out too in a second. Look at how dirty you get just clearing bamboo out of all things. I didn't realize bamboo was so dirty, but yeah. It's making us dirty. You definitely don't want to eat in this condition with all that grime on you. But we got a job to do. So let's do it. Oh, oh no. Boy. It's you not a big deal. Kidding me. We got the tools, we got the technology. It's called a rock and a stick. Clear some more stuff out. No, nope. hit the brush, but you know what? Yeah, let's do that first. No big deal. And now, let's deconstruct. There we go. And now we got some materials to work with. I know not as much as it took to make that, but it's not a big deal. Because we're going to build this house the way we want it. That's what's going to make us happy. We are getting dirty from this bamboo. Yep, yep. Okay, we're good. Little carbs, no big deal. Yeah, we got to clear some of this out. We want to keep it clean in here. the rain. Let's drink up. Let's get hydrated because we know these are going to be refilled. Fill up our bidons if we need to, but I think we're fine. I know it's slow moving, but we're doing really good. We're succeeding like right away. All of our needs are getting met. We're looking to build on what we have. This is good. Okay, one thing I like about the setup tool is that it, it shows you what you need to get out of the way. And in this, look at that over on the left. In this, over on, it, it's this, this bamboo here. <gasps> Basically what the tool is telling you is if you knock this down, you can build the structure you want. And that's what we're going to do. 
Oh, look at that. The rain made me less dirty. But at the same time, look at those fingers. It's like glistening. It's like moisture glistening. That's cool. Thunderstick, thunderstick. Clear this out, okay. Oh, we can build another one. Awesome. We're looking good. Let's put it down. I know that like I need to build this stuff in steps, but right now I just want to accomplish something really quickly. There we go. Put some ropes up now. Beautiful. And we get that completion sound. It's awesome. Placement rope. Got plenty. Gotta clear some brush. And at the same time, get some more raw materials. There we go. Perfect. Okay, this is gonna look good. This is gonna look real good. We're bringing sexy back on a deserted island. This is gonna look good. Just gotta make it happen. Bring the building materials out. Put it down. There we go. I know I said I would do this in better batches, but I just want to get this completed. I really do. Like, I want to see what it looks like. Okay, I need a couple more. No problem. We got plenty. We got plenty. You need rope? I got rope. I got you. And one more. There's that sound again. Perfect. Yep, replacement ropes. Okay, let's get these off the roofs. They've been falling from trees apparently, but you know what? We're going to make good use of them. Set these over here with the rest. No problem. Mm. Why not? But you see what we need. We don't need it right away, right away, but we definitely need some carbs eventually. So let's plan ahead. I see that bamboo stick right there. I want to take it. I don't know if it's part of the bed or not. It doesn't look like part of the bed. That's the main reason I want it. That's my white whale. One of these days, I'm going to get it. Okay. A lot of brush in the way. No problem. That's basically what it was saying. You got to clear this stuff out. And then you can build a structure. No problem. We can do that. There we go. Take 
pick all these up. Make something happen. Again, I am so freaking dirty just from picking up bamboo. Who knew that this was a dirty job? It's crazy. But apparently it is. Look how grimy I am. Proof is in the pudding. comes the sun. Nice. I know we're still just building the foundation of this base, but it's it's coming along pretty good. It really is. We gotta build some walls and stuff and then use a mud foundation, but we're doing really well. Really well. Boom. Whoops. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with this spot. I'd like a door right in the back so that when I come out from hunting, I can just walk right in. You know? So I'll put a wall there. I can probably build with like mud window, but not yet. Nah, we're gonna make this look good. Need four more? Perfect, no problem. I got you. I got you. So I think I want to put a doorway back here. So that when I have stuff, like meat and whatnot, I can just bring it through the rear. Perfect. Let's pick up a full haul real quick. There we go. Drop them all down. Okay, I need one more. Okay, that didn't work. Apparently, you need one at the top. Alright, you say so. I'll pick one up. There we go. Now we're good. Now we're good. Yeah, there's going to be a doorway there. There's going to be probably a window. Maybe a wall. Until the sweat pours down my... I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. We don't need to go there. So, I know a lot of people are like partial to the banana leaf roof. But I don't really care. I just want it to be covered. That's all I want. I don't need like validation from my banana leaves bro I'm totally good using these palm leaves your problem is you aren't edgy enough man like you need to take it to the edge there we go no problem, once again, no problem. Pick that log up. I swear to God, there's so much growth over here, it's crazy. Oh, that made a noise. That made a noise, unlike the bamboo logs, that made a noise. Alright, moving on. We're gonna have a roof over our heads. Yeah, we'll just, just a little bit more. This is a lot more, but I'm still gonna take it. Oh yeah, that is a lot more.
It works. I'm serious though. Look at this. This was not here yesterday. All this growth. It's crazy. Is that, is that gonna happen every now and then? You're gonna be like... Oh wait. Again. Last place you look. <sighs> Boom. This should be easy. We should be able to complete this. And one more to grow on. Boom. I'm going side for this. It's a weird angle. There we go. We got a little mud station. Yep, gotta wash ourselves off though. Just in case we accidentally eat something. That's a big deal. It can ruin your day. Those parasites. But again, you can also eat shrimp right out the box for a protein boost, which is what I just did. Alright, so I slept for a minute and woke up and I found this little tortoise. I'm gonna knock him on the head. Sorry buddy, but I need your shell. It's nothing personal. Well, got some carbs, eat and run, pick up some for the road, right on man, right on. I have to build another fire, but I don't have the materials exactly. I'll make some. There we go. Almost. Okay. So I need more sticks. No problem. No problem at all. Got one right there. I'll find another one soon enough. Nope. Nope. I'm not gonna harvest that. Gonna keep it. The only sticks you want to harvest are gonna be just the regular sticks and the small sticks. There we go. There we go. We found the other one. Boom. Alright. Let's make some soup. too tired no big deal no big deal at all we'll let him get some rest and we'll start this fire sooner enough all right so I got some legitimate shut eye so I'm well rested might actually be able to uh, <laughs> start a fire this time we'll see how well that goes and uh, kind of get started to the day. I plan on having a very productive day today. Get some more construction done, things like that. Of course, first, address my vitals. Got everything kind of organized the way that I like it. And, uh, let's see here. This one's better. Let's see, I gotta assume the position here. Get ready to hear his frustration, of course. That's not me, that's him. Yes! Yes! Also his excitement. There we go. Just gonna get that soup cooking. Cook 
pick up some frog legs. Some of the meat that we had left over. And this should get us uh, get us, us off to a good start, most definitely. Got some backup manners. Stowaways again. <coughs> Take a hike. <laughs> it's like a morning routine. Eat, drink, remove leeches. <laughs> All right. So uh, yesterday we had gotten the, the window put up. We've got a little framework here to work with. Put a window up or you know, a wall or whatever. It's just, uh, you know, if, if it's, it's aesthetically pleasing to you, you know, you can go with like a wall if you don't want everything but windows. Um, the thing to keep in mind is that it takes more mud. The nice thing about windows is that it takes less mud. And of course you can see outside the wall. But, you know, if you want to mix it up and everything and you're not really necessarily worried about that, I know I'm not, then um, you can go ahead and just kind of build it the way that you want. And yes, I am going to cave and do some of these banana leaves up top. Just don't tell your mother. We've got a couple left over here. We can always get more if we need to. There's a couple more banana leaf plants that don't give bananas and the young ones. Right, there we go. On the money. Doesn't that look cute? That's great. I guess I'll put another one the same type over here just to kind of keep things matching. <clears throat> Place this. I think I've got one more pile of ash that I can do that with so that we can create some more uh, mud bricks and we'll take advantage of the fact that it's raining right now. When you uh, put the ash in there, there it is, perfect. You put the ash in there, then the rain takes care of the water and you don't have to go back and forth carting uh, swamp water to it. Looks like it's uh, almost done. There we go. Now my favorite part. Uh, welcome to the Hotel California, baby. <laughs> Just have fun with it. And we've got more mud bricks. I don't think we're going to have enough. I think we're going to be one short, if I remember correctly. 
but that's okay. Um, one of the things I'm I, I definitely going to build, um, not in this episode, but very soon, um, is going to be a furnace, and that's going to give us free access to, or practically free access to uh, coal and ash. So it's going to make life a lot simpler. If I remember correctly, you get three ash each time you use the furnace, and quite a bit of charcoal. Yeah, we're one short. No problem. No problem at all. Harvest this guy. You can never have too many rocks at this stage of the game. Especially with, uh, with the luck I've had with these stone axes. Oh yeah, right there. You see how dirty I am? You see the rain slowly washing it away. And apparently, uh, I was a little too dirty for the rain. Macaw or a toucan or something, uh, voicing his displeasure, I guess, of the house I'm building. Doesn't like me moving in, I guess. <laughs> okay, so what next? Yeah, we're gonna need one more mud. We'll get to that in a little bit. You know, if we lose our fire, then we'll be able to make another one as well, because we'll have more camp ash uh, or uh, you know, a pile of ash. And, uh, yeah, maybe I'll just let it run out. I don't know. We'll see. Get that ready. Okay. Back this up. There we go. All the while, trying not to back up too much so that I fall into the into the lake, the river, the swamp, whatever that is. I think we should have enough here. It's going to come down to the wire. There we go. Let's figure this out. Just got to find the right spot. <coughs> uh, jumping doesn't help. Okay. Noted. There we go. There's that frickin' long bamboo pole. My favorite thing on this island. Stick. Stick. Okay. I think we got enough here. Yeah. And done. Well, look at that. We pretty much practically have our own certified structure here. I like it. Okay, now we got a monkey yelling at us. That's nice. Hopefully I get this to fall the right way. I hate it when they fall into the water. Yeah, okay, perfect. Things are things keep going our way. Until they don't, of course. But right now they're going our way, so we're gonna keep moving forward. <laughs> Again, no sound. On a huge pile of bamboo trunks. Here. There we go. That way we're gonna have plenty. And you can pick up six of these at once. Basically need like two and a half trips, you know. Give or take. to come together. It's starting to look pretty good. We're dirty as hell, but that's okay. Stick. Stick. Okay, what we're going to do, we're going to hit this, but we got to make sure we don't hit the structure. <gasps> oh, shit! <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> that's awesome. I lined everything up took so much time to make sure it was perfect and then the thing broke. Oh, this game. This game gets me. I love it. Alright. There we go. Good. I just didn't want to accidentally hit the structure and damage it. Ooh. 
key? Ah, oak, okay, cool. Uh, so do I'm not falling in the water. Oh, luck, not oak. Finally run out. Let's see. Oh, wait, okay, there it is. Perfect. That's a weird way all this fell, but again, I'm not going to ask any questions. Oh, see some mushrooms over there. Okay. Yep. Looks like we can put another frame over here, which is gonna be, which is gonna be nice. There we go. Yes, perfect. Okay, fantastic. All right, we pick just a couple of these bad boys up. Get the right angle. Oh, we get another bath. Fantastic. Come on. Peek, peek, peek. There we go. Right. Come on. There we go. Not too bad. Nothing too insane. Okay. Put that guy up there and get four more. Oh, love that long bamboo pole. That's fun. I fall for it every freaking time. Stick. Yeah, I need yeah, to take that with me it over there with the other so I don't lose track of it. And we need four more, I think. Yeah, we had the one over there already. Alright, cool. Fantastico. Alright, we got well, Let's rope her down. We are one step closer to being too cool for school. I'm always late on the draw. That's okay. No problem. We'll resolve that later. Too blue. There we go. Okay, so things are starting to look good. This is starting to look like a... Uh, structure that is going to protect us from the elements and uh yeah it's gonna be good let's see here okay that looks good right there and again two and a half trips that should do it. <laughs> oh, cool. Little, little bird's nest here. That's good. Okay. This will, uh, this will act as a backup for us. There's special slots on our backpack under the fire making section of it. See right there? Just in case we ever go out in the field, we've got a little backup bird nest to, to help light our fires. We can use it as kindling. Oop. Yeah, okay, we got a little Goliath bird eater spider here. These aren't just pests either. Now they can't hurt you. I've never been bitten by one, but I think that uh, it has venom in it. And, you know, you'll need the tobacco leaf. But you can actually make uh, bandages, bandages with this stuff. You just gotta cook him on the fire. And you wanna burn him. Don't just, don't just cook it. But literally just put them on there and then just walk away because once it gets burned you can grind it into a powder by harvesting it and then just putting it on a bandage it's good stuff what are we on our half trip I can't remember <laughs> out of our two and a half no nope, no nope, not quite looks like that was our second trip and these right here, I know they look like palm leaves, but they don't give you any. It's just considered brush to clear. So let's see. Oh, hey, little guy. Fantastic. That taken care of. My favorite long bamboo pole right there. Always gonna give it a shout out. 
<laughs> when I go by, because I always fall for it. Yeah, here we go. Let's just cut this guy down. And then we can call this, at least this one little project, call a day on it. Call it a day on it. And one more to grow on. Just can't believe how dirty you get. I'm not gonna eat these. I'll take these and I'll cook them. I think the amount of energy that you get from it is negligible, but I guess when you combine the two together, it's not it's not terrible. Good lord! It sounds like somebody's choking a monkey. Did you hear that? Boom. Okay, so it's starting to look halfway decent. I like it. Yeah, first we're going to work on this structure, and then the one that I just walked by made out of wood. Then we'll work on that one over off to the left. First I want to get this guy taken care of. And we'll make something pretty over there. something to do in this game. Like, you never just are going to sit there and stare at a fire for 30 minutes, you know? Stick. There they are. Okay. Yeah, this is going to help, um, you know, even us out. Yeah, there we go. Just pick these up and eat them. Good to go. Are there any others? Need a couple more. Okay, good, good, good. And this, this oops. Let me scoot over. Again, don't want to destroy that structure. I was accidentally hitting it. This guy. And this should uh, complete our little banana banana leaf project. Banana leaf roof project. There we go. And you know what? After that, I think I'm going to call it a day. Uh, we still need to get some more ash, which we'll get taken care of. But if you like this video, if you like my style, please hit the like, and like button and subscribe to our channel. It would mean a lot to me. I would love continuing to crank these videos out for you because I've said many times before, I am obsessed with this, with this game. Thank you for watching and see you next time.